I think my one personal favorite is students studying between the gap with books, right? And that that's my personal favorite, right? You know, they just you know, I see so many students doing this, and that's a big mistake. Don't you agree, guys? I mean, you studying in that gap, right, causes stress, and does it help? I mean, no, what's your all. opinion on no it? Chance. So, right. so, in fact, I would like to add a point there. So, I remember uh, five or six years back, we started a trend. We What we used to do is, uh, in fact, that was an analysis post uh, one of the student, Shubham, who got All India Rank 6. With him, when I was analyzing his prep, uh, you know, preparation, I realized that his score in the paper 2 used to decrease drastically oh, oh. as compared to paper 1. And then with discussion with him, we realized that he felt a little bit tired during the paper too. Post all the discussion and everything, we realized that he should sleep between these, you know, uh, this two hours. And for that, we started asking him to sleep and he used to sleep on bench initially. And then we had that uh, mattresses uh, on uh, available for him during that two hours. But that really helped him. And when he went, after 15 days of time, we saw that his paper 2 marks increased by 20%, which is not a mean thing. And he was scoring an average of 65 to 66% in the initial days. From there, he actually took it to 75 just by doing this. Right. And from 75, fin finally, he went uh, to 84, 85. And on the given day, he got that percentage. Very interesting. So, so this is what uh, we, uh, you know, uh, started that. And right. I think uh, that is one of the good practices. That if you can take a nap of 15-20 minutes, that would be very good for paper 2. You, you will be very fresh. Like sir said, you should sleep in between the gap and not discuss the paper <laughs> in the gap because very, that's very important. Otherwise, very important. Like, <laughs> otherwise, you take that stress to the paper 2 and that means reduces your score further. So, don't discuss the paper in the break. Sleep, eat and 2 hours will pass anyways. <laughs> it's because you have to reach the center half an hour before or something. So, right. I think not discussing the paper in the break, I think would be the most important advice from that, you know, thing is uh, very, very critical. Yeah, a any difference in approach Prano, from your side required? Uh, not, no difference, but an add-on would be when you uh, are sleeping or relaxing during the two hours, leave alone discussing, don't even think of the paper, right? Don't even try to analyze whether you solved a particular question correctly or not. Because suppose you didn't solve it correctly, then it is going to affect your next one. And also, I often heard, my means of having passed it, yeah. I've heard that my peers say that second paper was tougher than the first one. Uh -huh. Frankly speaking, now if you look at the papers, you'll find them to be equal. Yeah. So that tougher, like sir said, it's all because you're tired. Right. So like, yeah. I took a nap between my two papers yeah. and I felt it made a difference. That's amazing. That's a great, uh, you know, that's a great takeaway from this.